What is up YouTube, Dominic here with Nintendo in Time, and uh, today I have a special package that arrived right at my doorstep, and as you can tell, this is from Amazon Japan, and uh, it, as always it has a smile on the package, and it's a bit of a thin box as you can tell. So uh, one thing that I love on my 3DS is the Badge Arcade, and I check the arcade probably like every single day for new badges, and I spend probably more than I should probably spend on it. And it's just something that I'm really addicted to and I'm really into it. I think it's a great way to, um, I think it's a great way to kind of keep coming back to Nintendo every day checking your 3DS. So I kind of, by now I have a lot of badges since I check it every day. So I have about, uh, let's see if you can tell right there. I have 621 badges in total, so I think that's quite a bit. So, uh, I'm pretty addicted to it. And um, so anyways, moving on from this. Um, in Japan, they release an actual sticker book, um, 301 stickers based off of the badges in the badge arcade. How awesome is that? So I had to get it. So that's why I made the account just to get it. And I bought two of the books, um, one to kind of give out stickers to people and one to keep and have all the stickers in a complete set. So hopefully you enjoy this unboxing. I'm really hyped to check this out, guys. Nintendo time. What is up guys, Dominic here with Nintendo in Time, and we're going to go ahead and start this unboxing of the Badge Arcade Sticker Book, which is uh, only available in Japan as of right now. So let's go ahead and get started. I have my trusty uh, Amiibo opening knife. I'm going to be opening this uh, package from Amazon. Alright, let's go ahead and get started with this. Alright. Okay. Alright, let's go ahead and get started with this. Throw this packing receipt out. Oh, so they're a lot smaller than I thought. They're about the size of my hand, as you can tell right there. I thought they were going to be like a giant book, but uh, I still have hope for this, so let's check it out. And I ordered two. One to give stickers. Oh, I actually really like this. Alright, so first off, we have uh, stickers from the Super Mario series. So we see the classic uh, Mario, Luigi, Peach, and then the Koopas. Personally, I love the Koopas. And uh, you have Diddy Kong and Donkey Kong in the bottom left. And then some enemies in the bottom. Of course, the Yoshi sticker classic. Uh, let's see what's on the next page. Alright, on the next page, we have what looks like the enemies of the Mushroom Kingdom. So we have Wario, Baby Bowser. Oh, that's so cool. We have, oh, Dry Bones in the bottom right. That's freaking, oh, the booze. I never even noticed those booze. Awesome. Lakitu in the top right. Look at that Wario. Look at his buff little arm. I like that. Cool, I'm definitely going to be uh, using these stickers. Alright, next up we have the Mario Kart stickers. Um, so we have a Pink Old Peach, Toad, Toadette. Oh, look at there's Isabel on the top right. That's freaking awesome. They put DLC characters in here. And then you have some of the items in the bottom. Like you have the uh, music note. That's so cool. And then the, the cow. That's awesome. I love that they have the baby characters too. Hopefully there's more uh, Mario Kart on the next page. Alright, so now we have more Mario Kart stickers. Nice. So we have uh, the rest of the characters. We have Metal Mario and all the items in the bottom. I love and I hate those items at the same time. Um, let's see. Oh, there's Link and a motorcycle. Nice. I'm loving that they put the DLC characters in this. That's so freaking cool. Next up, we have the 8-Bit Mario stickers. Nice. So we have a classic 8-Bit Mario on top. And then we have a suited Mario in the middle. And then a Santa Claus Mario in the bottom. I love the Santa Claus Mario. And then you have all these uh, little... Looks like Japanese kind of influenced Mario items on the bottom. That's so cool. I'm loving the Mario and the Luigi backpack too. I wish they actually sold that backpack. I would totally get it. Next up, we have Animal Crossing. Just like in the beginning of the book, we saw some Isabel stickers. So let's see what we have here. We have Timmy and Tommy. We have Mabel. Oh, nice. We have Digby in the bottom right looking smug. Oh, this is really cool. Hopefully, we get some more Animal Crossing on the next page. All right, next up we have Isabel. Oh, this is awesome. I'm loving her little chubby faces and all these um, photos right here. I like the uh, top right with her little tooth popping out. And KK Slider. Oh, I know there's going to be a fight to see who gets that sticker. Um, then we have Captain. Cool. Really liking these stickers. Nice. This is probably one of the coolest pages because there's so many Isabel stickers. Obviously, Isabel is a fan favorite for anyone that loves Animal Crossing. And uh, there's a lot of these suits here that I don't recognize her in. I'm liking her in the uh, leopard in the bottom right. And also... I'm liking her in the uh, Samus suit. That's really cool. I wish we get we got these badges in the uh, American Badger Cave. All right, next up is the Legend of Zelda Wind Waker stickers. Oh, these are awesome. I'm loving these bright colors and um, that art style really translates to sticker format. So I'm loving how these look. Oh, I like the little grandma too on the right. I'm gonna be using her. <laughs> oh, more Wind Waker stickers. Awesome. Okay, everyone's favorite, favorite, favorite character of all time, Tingle, in the middle of the page. 
And then we have a, I love the uh, Triforce logos, how they look. They look so cool on their own. They're simple and they look so cool. And then you have the heart icons in the bottom. Oh, these look freaking awesome. Then you have a Ganondork in the bottom. It looks so cool. So now we have a Splatoon. So this is a relatively new series for Nintendo and it's been a hit. I know in Japan they're loving it so much they even have tournaments like regularly on this game. So it's nice to see this uh, series represented right out of the gate. So we have the uh, Squid Sisters and you have all the squids in the bottom. Alright, so, oh nice, so there's more Splatoon stickers, it's nice to see the fashion items, they give you power-ups in the game, and it's cool to see the Inkling Boy and Girl and all the accessories that you can have in the game. So that's really cool. So next up we have some Swap Note stickers, so personally whenever I see a Swap Note panel in the Badger Arcade, I always 100% complete it, because I love the Swap Note stickers. I don't spend a lot of time on Swap Note, but I just love the art style and the art direction for this series. So let's, hopefully we get another page of this, let's check it out. Nice, I love when they're so, I love the little stickers because you can fit a lot more little stickers on one um, page. So we have a lot of swap note stickers here. We have Halloween theme, Christmas, we have uh, summer theme, Valentine's theme, Japanese theme. It's really cool to see some more swap note representation for Nintendo. I think it's been really popular in the Badger Arcade. So next up we have Rusty Real Deal Baseball. I've never really played this game, but I like the uh, direction of it. It's like American. So there's like a baseball and there's a like classic uh, American boy in the bottom. I like the kid with the gray hair. So maybe I'll check that game out. And last but not least, we have the Badger Cade Bunny. So he's super expressive in the game and you have all his little emotions and expressions right here. It's cool to see the black and white bunny with the hair draped over, the gothic bunny. It's cool to see the real life bunny when you have to use real life money. And then his boss is even in there too in the middle of the page. And then you have the buff bunny. He personally makes Badger Cade that much more uh, addictive to me, so I'm, I'm loving this Badger Cade bunny stickers. Now we reach the end of the book, so we're greeted with the bunny, he's probably telling us to buy some more stickers, spend some more money on him, and as usual, we love to hate him. Now we have the back of the book, which shows the bunny, and it shows a little screenshot from the 3DS Badger Cade, that's so cool. Thanks for watching that video. If you're interested in getting one of these sticker books, um, leave a comment and I'll help you sort it out. It's not that expensive. It was about 700 yen, which is about like six or five uh, American dollars. So it's not too bad and the process is pretty painless. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that video. Until next time, guys, Nintendo in time.